Now, uh, from your bugbear mate to mine, Graham Annesley has come out this week and said that Terrell May should have been cited and potentially suspended. The referee's boss has pretty much said, I know better than the match review committee, which of course has set people off on social media saying, well, why don't you charge him then? And they're saying, well, you know, they get they get preferential treatment, obviously, the Panthers, and maybe they do, maybe they don't. What good comes from Annesley saying that? Him coming out, I understand, and saying, look, we penalise because... Should he be saying anything about the match review committee? I actually like it. I like Graham Manersley saying the match... Oh, look, hold on, let's flip that back there. I hate Graham Annesley's Monday review because... He only picks one or two things from the weekend. He doesn't talk about how atrocious six of his eight referees were or how, you know, like in in one game, you could go through a Chris Butler game and you could scrutinize every single call that he makes and Annesley would be there for a day. What about the Mitch Kenny where he falls five meters short and breaststroked to the line yep. and put it down and they go, yep, all good momentum. Breaststrokes this one. That's freestyle, I feel freestyle. like. Freestyle. I, I mean, even some butterfly to get that ball over the line. He flipped over on his back for a minute. <laughs> I I don't mind Annesley coming out and saying, hey, look, the match review committee got this wrong because for many, many years, people have been bagging the match review committee saying it needs a rejink, it needs, you know, whatever it is. Do I think Terrell May should have been charged and suspended? No. But I don't think Dal Finucan should have been a couple of years ago either. Should he, Finucane, have been penalised on the night? Yeah, absolutely he should have. Should have been penalised. I think Terrell May was right to be penalised and put on report, but I don't think he should have been suspended for that. It was an accident. And as Ivan Cleary said, the referee said to Nathan on the field, he didn't bend his back. Or he didn't bend at the hips and, and put the shoulder. If he had done that, there's a broken jaw for Reese Walsh, and he's out, he's out for longer. So... I don't, I don't mind honestly taking shots at the match review committee because they're so inconsistent. Like, they are so, so... In, like, we had Jerome Luai trip and hit someone high and only get a, a couple of fines. But you got Leo Thompson missing a week for an accident. It's it's so, so, so inconsistent. Yeah, I don't disagree with that. I hate the match review committee. I, I think it's like a lot But I hate of- Graham Annesley as well. I think he's a terrible referees boss. And I think all the eight referees that we've got this weekend are dreadful. So what do you do? Look, there you go. I, I, look, it's no win, I get it. But going back to what you said before, this Monday morning thing, all it does is give opposition teams and coaches a reason to whinge. And they go in and go, we thought the refs tonight were terrible. And they go, we're going to fine you. But on Monday, we're going to say you were right. Yeah. What good comes from this? And I thought this was overstepping. He shouldn't have said that. He should have said, look, it's a penalty. And if a charge was warranted, so be it. Because, again, it's just given everyone ammo to go off on this anti penalty agenda, yourself and me included. But, I mean, what good comes of it? You can't have it. Leave the calling out to people like us. Well, yeah, yeah, the other thing as well is he goes in there on a Monday morning on a contentious call and he he only gives his opinion on it, right? So he will t- you'll be sitting there fuming all weekend at a call that went against your team. And you'll be sitting there going, oh, I can't wait for Graham Mansley to go in there and say that I was right. And then Graham Mansley goes in there and goes, yeah, that call was correct. So you're still fuming. So for him to go there and, and just give his opinion on it, I don't think that's the right look.